What's up, everyone? I'm here in Seattle, Washington, and I'm going to be taking the monorail between the Seattle Space Needle and downtown at the Westlake Shopping Center. Today's date is Wednesday, April 26, 2023. Time is about 4.30 p.m. and it's 63 Fahrenheit, 17 Celsius. This uh, Space Needle is probably the most iconic structure in Seattle. It's currently an observation tower, but it was built for the 1962 World's Fair. And you can go up it right now. The tickets are about $37 and change, but they're less expensive depending on what time you go. Before noon, I believe it's 32 and change and after 6 p.m. is 35 and change. Here's the monorail. I think uh, monorail leaves every 10 minutes. Fun, fast, direct transportation to the heart of downtown Seattle. It was known as the Alweg monorail because it was built in Germany. Also known as the Disney Disneyland monorail. It's the last existing original Alweg line in the world. And it costs $3.50 to ride one way for adults. Youth is $1.75. Let's uh, purchase a ticket one way. Cards and contactless payment only. One way, one adult. Tap to pay. Okay, let's tap to pay. Tap here. Let me just do that off camera. Keycad beeps. Thank you. Enjoy your trip. Collect your tickets below, and it's right there. Oh, there's another monorail coming. I think one is going to leave soon. So we scan this here. Easy. Let's go to the front of this train. It does look like this train is a continuous uh, train though. We can walk through the whole train. It does look like a monorail from Disney. Hey! I've ridden the uh, Disney World monorail. It was similar to this. All right. We are on the monorail. Here's the view of the front. Wow, lots of leg room here. Some seating in the middle. Stay clear of this area while the train is in motion. Got some skylights in here. Very cool. And uh, 
the route map, which you cannot get lost because there's only two stops. They just run between each other. The uh, Seattle Center and West Lake Center. Super cool. I like the jingle that the monorail makes when you scan the ticket. It's kind of cool. Oh, did you know the monorail travels one mile in 90 seconds, operating usually at speeds up to 45 miles an hour? So cool. Going through the Museum of Pop. traveling quite fast. I didn't expect to get this much acceleration from the monorail. It's nice to actually ride this monorail when it's not raining. Get a nice view. And it looks like we've arrived. Westlake Center. That was much quicker than I thought. I thought it was going to take 10 minutes. It was like more like three, to be honest. It's a two minute one way. Oh, two minute one way? Minute one way? Oh. So if you stay on and go all the way back to Seattle Center, that's 10 minutes. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. I was close. Please remain seated. We're going to pull forward oh. one inch. One inch. One inch. One inch. <laughs> Got it. Okay. Hey. Thank you very much and have a beautiful day. Thank you. Yay, the talented Seattle monorail drivers. <laughs> Bye. Wow, that was so fast. And we are here inside the uh, Westlake Shopping Center. It looks futuristic, this turnstile gate. All right. And if you are interested, the Pike Place Market is about a five minute walk down to the waterfront. So this is very convenient to get between the major tourist attractions of Seattle.
Oh, thank you. All right, everyone, that was the Seattle monorail trip. Quite a smooth experience, although it did rattle a lot very quick. Appreciate all of you joining. Hit that like button, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye, everyone. Take care.